Hello, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sharon, aka the Mel Nostalgic Runner. And we are back again for a Get Fit With Me series presents accountability. And I'm not gonna hold you, this is not gonna be very long of a accountability series this time around because I do just have some updates going on and I kind of want to share that. Um, as you probably have known, if you watch my um, Seeing Things Differently series and then the last Get Fit With Me presents accountability, you may know that um, so the look is looking a little different and not in the best way. Um, I still do have my allergy related shiner and I got it during my trip to Puerto Rico. It is going down by actually a lot. It was looking so much worse. So this is coming from here and it's coming from here. So I'm not sick. I'm still, I'm actually fine for the most part. I'm actually for the most part able to breathe again, but yeah, my sciences and I, we were fighting that whole entire trip and Puerto Rico and the environment that it won. But anyway, that's not why we're here. The other reason why I want to have an update is I think I might have shared with you guys, I actually rolled my ankle while I was on vacation. And when I rolled my ankle, it was much worse than I thought it was. So as a result, I have only ran like twice since my vacation to the point where this race, I was actually not even able to do. I was supposed to do it last Sunday and I could tell it was not the best idea. I had um, a massage scheduled to get things worked on anyway on that day. So I actually opted and just did that and did not even bother trying to do the race. It is better, but it's still not 100%. But the good news and bad news is I have yet another update. So I think I mentioned I was training for a half. Well, I found out last week when I went to try to, you know, sign up for the half. It's already sold out. So the half is not happening now, which in a way is a blessing because <laughs> I have not been able to train the way I want to. And, um... Yeah, so we're okay on that. But the good news is I do still have my 50K I'm doing in the fall. That is still up and running. I do also have a couple triathlons I want to do this. Well, I have a sprint triathlon and a super sprint triathlon I'm going to do um, this summer as well. The sprint triathlon is the same one I did last year. I want to try to beat my time and actually hopefully my running times improved along my swimming time. Cycling time. I want it to stay the way it is, if, or if not better, because I killed that cycling last year um, in the best way possible. Um, and then I have my super, I have a super sprint that I'm doing in the fall, but it's the Chicago Triathlon Super Sprint. So that also means it's going to be my first open water swim that I've ever done. So that will help me be able to focus on that more. So there is that. Also, too, I have been doing better about going to the gym. Uh, last week, I bumped it up to two times going to the gym, and I ran one time, and then I didn't do yoga at all last week. So this time around, this week, we're going to try to go to the gym all four times, and then we're also going to try to get as much of the running in as we can, depending on if it feels good or not, and then we're also going to do the yoga. So I am going to try to work my way up as far as like um, getting my workouts back in order. It's just... Um, my distance will still be the same too for the most part because this is around the time where I would have been training or start my training for the 50K anyway. So we're doing okay. So even though I did not sign up the way I wanted to, we're still in good shape. So there is that. And side note, I need to redo my hair because my curls are not doing what I want them to do. But that's okay. Anyway, so... Um, I did get off of, you know, really giving you the progress of my half marathon training, but now you know why. Um, there will be no half marathon. <laughs> um, I am still going to try to run the distance. Um, I also do still have a Soldier Field 10 miler I'm doing two weeks before that, and I have a 10K I'm doing week after. So the running is still going to happen. I'm going to still try to run with my running group on Saturday, and I started cycling. So I actually biked to the gym yesterday and went to the gym and then biked home. So I'm adding cycling back into the routine and then swimming is going to be adding. I'm going to be adding that fairly soon too. So 
even though the running's not where I want it to be, we'll get back to where it needs to be in no time. So I just wanted to give you a little bit of a content update and also just let you know, I'm not discouraged. I did not give up. We're still doing all the things. It's just, I had a minor setback and either you give up, which I got kind of did that last year, or you do what I'm doing this year and you're like, take it by the chin and keep it pushing. And that's what I'm planning on doing. But anyway, I kind of wanted to give you just a content update and that's pretty much all I'm doing here. Um, yeah, short and sweet this time around. Please like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you get anything out of the content. It's your girl Sharon, aka The Melon Nostalgic Runner. I will see you next time. Bye.